Hey guys, what is up? The new Cubist here. Welcome to episode five, my sur episode five of my survival let's play. So, in the last episode, we had a few eventful things happen. If you missed it, and if you're new to the series, welcome. If you want to catch up and watch all the videos, feel free. But if not, we're at we're at a good point. We don't have much yet. We have a little home base and a few things, but this episode I wanted to clear out the area around our house a little bit and then from there maybe fix up the bridges a little bit. So I want to have a few leaves on me for that and then definitely of some cobblestone. We're going to need to make some walls and then I'm not really sure what else I want to add. I definitely want to do a bunch more of those lanterns because I absolutely I love the way they look like a lot. So let's actually make a few of those real quick. We only have two torches, so we might want to get a little bit more iron. There we go. Or a little bit more coal. Where did I put the coal? Okay. So let's go ahead and... Uh, I didn't grab wood. I know I have a bunch of wood somewhere. Okay, that's what I want to use. Spruce. Okay, so I have a living chest somewhere. There it is. So let's put these snow berries up for now. And then we don't need that. That uh, We only need like a stack of those. Might as well smelt up these salmons too. So we have those. Smoke up the salmon, I guess. It wouldn't be salmons, but eh, whatever. I digress. Let's get a little bit of sticks going. Make some torches. Just a few. <laughs> just a few. So this is enough for eight lanterns. Okay. We're going to need a bunch more than eight. Hopefully that's... Okay. It's 34. Okay, that gives us... Oh. I was like, surely that gave us more than that. Okay. And then 12 lanterns. 20 lanterns? Um... That should be okay for now. We'll see. If we need more, we need more. But I just really like the way these things look. And it's kind of cool because you have to mine them with a, an actual uh, a pickaxe. So I wanted to clear out this area just because I feel like this is a good area to sort of start building some stuff. So it's going to lag and it's going to be loud. So I apologize. But I'm just going to be mining this. Nothing too crazy. But it's so fun to do with shears. Like, I think it's so much fun. And then as we go, I'll just sort of mine the stumps and stuff. Because there's just little stumps, and you don't have to mine them by hand. But I also want to have a bunch of jungle leaves for maybe a few projects. Uh, these big trees, I'm just going to leave them. They're fine. I'm mainly just concerned about these little tiny things on the ground. So, But I love the color of grass in the jungle. I know it would be easier just to go to that, um, that spruce biome I have right over there. But I honestly just really like how... Uh, I like, I like I like doing this. It's so fun to be. It's so satisfying. But uh, yeah, I just like the color of grass here. So we're just gonna stay here, and uh, should be good. Should be nice and fun. Oh my gosh! I already have. I knew I was gonna need so many more than three. These things don't last a whole long time. There's a bunch of. We probably already have our inventory full. <laughs> oh yeah, easy. Maybe we should make a few barrels. Hold on. Before I even get. Before I get further into this than I need to, I should probably get a few barrels for our, um, yeah, we're definitely going to need a couple barrels out here somewhere. Well, we already have a bunch of, like, storage, so we don't need to craft any barrels. Just go down in here. Let's just plop these. I don't want to use the living chest, but the chest right next to it should be fine. So I don't think I need to worry. Oh, yeah, there was already coal in there. Put coal in here. Why not? A little flint, too? Okay. I just want leaves in here, but we can put these right here. Okay. Okay. Saplings. Okay, cool. All right, let's get into here. I don't have any chest crafted. I'm trying to use the 1.4 blocks. I know that there's a grindstone, and that's cool, but it's not, it doesn't have a whole lot of use. The new blocks really don't, uh, aside from building. Like, all the new building blocks are incredible. I wish I could look at all of them, and I think I kind of can, like, here in a way. Ah, uh, okay, so it's telling me I need a vine. Or surely that's not all the blocks, but what on the achievements do we need to do? Okay, so... Catch a fish. Tame an animal. That's probably a good idea. A seedy place. Completely use up a diamond hoe and then reevaluate your life choices. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that would be kind of crazy. I think they have like 2,000 something durability. So that's a big farm. If you use all of it, not one, like one diamond hoe, that would be so, so big. Like, that'd be a huge farm. Um... I'm not sure how far I want to do this. I wanted to clear out this whole area, but I realize now this much be this this is going to be a much bigger undertaking than I had uh, previously uh, estimated. So we're just going to do this piece by piece, and uh, hopefully maybe this episode will just be me building because I wanted to go mining, and I kind of did last episode, but I got blown up by a creeper, and that sort of threw a wrench in things. But I still got a bunch of iron, like a 
a little bit over a stack, which is nice. But I'll come back through here, and uh, I'll just break the logs after. It should be pretty simple. But yeah, that's a lot of... I know it's loud, and you... Oh, man. Where are you? Okay, more shears it is. So we have a ton of stuff in our inventory. We need to clean this, and we also need to mine this. Bother me. Okay. I'm going to go get... Uh, I'm going to put these up, and then I'm going to get my inventory cleaned out, because it is full of crap, and I don't need it for that full of stuff. So let's put these leaves up. All varieties of leaves welcome. And then... I just need to make item frames and start sticking them on there. It'll be make this a lot easier. So like what I was saying is I have a junk. Yeah, we don't need that or that or that. Um, we should make another axe, but we already have. Okay, so let's do this. Let's make. Well, first things first. Let's just make a bunch of these, and then a bunch of these because I'm not gonna need any more of those for now. Let's make two axes. Okay, let's make three picks. Because I know I'll need those. So let's make one more sword. And then we'll make a hoe. And we'll make two shovels. And then I don't think I'll need much else except for more shears. I wanted to make iron, but guys, I don't think... Oh, well, okay. We'll throw this cobblestone on the ground for now. Okay, bone. Don't need it. Bone. Don't need it. Okay, and then this. Okay. And then string. That's really bothering me doing it like that. I think that should be enough. Okay. Um, we don't need all these tools right now. I'll put these in the good tools chest. I'll keep one extra of each thing on me. But we don't need we don't need like a hoe right now. And uh, we, don't, we don't even have a shovel. Okay. We got an extra axe. Bone meal. That should go in the living things chest, right? Yeah. And then what else in here do we not need? We don't need a spider eye. They can go in there. Uh, we have these lanterns and sticks. We don't need mossy cobblestone. I'm gonna put it in the rare chest just because that's where it belongs in my eyes. Just because of that's how it used to be. And then we don't need we don't need all these shears. Okay, we don't need all these shears on us. Maybe just we'll go grab some more. But we're definitely gonna need a good bit, as we found out. Uh, we don't need that many sticks either. Okay, arrows. I mean, they kind of would. We'll just stick them in there. They they it feels like they'd fit in there. Um, we don't need two shovels. I mean, axe, and then two swords, and the sword should be right there. And then shovel, like this. And these should honestly be in the end. Okay, cool. That's pretty organized. I don't really think we're going to need torches this second, and then let's just put this stuff up in here. Okay, nice. So, ugh, I forgot all that stuff. Okay, I forgot all that stuff was there. So, okay, you know what? We'll just do. We have cobblestone somewhere. I really need item frames. I really need them because I'm gonna keep getting confused. Okay, where's the wood? Okay, here. We don't need sticks and then this stuff is... Okay, we'll put it in there because it's like drops. So I figure like all the living things that make stuff go in there. Okay. So the bridge I want to be... Like the bridges. I'm gonna keep them flat, but I'm going to make them look a little bit fancier because as you guys know, I'm pretty good at fancying things up, so we'll do something with that. Should be pretty easy, I think. Although, the thing about building in survival versus creative is like, in, in creative, you can try out a bunch of things and see what works, but in survival, if you were to craft like a bunch of one thing and then it turns out it looks bad, you're just kind of, you just got to kind of go with it because you, you already made it and you're probably not going to use it for anything else. And I know it's probably impossible to hear me right now. I'll probably see this on the when I'm editing it and be like, why was this so loud? Oh yeah, <laughs> and I'll probably change it. So don't worry, it shouldn't be too terribly loud. Okay, okay, there we go. I don't know how far I want to go with this, but I do know that I wanted kind of a decently sized area to sort of work with here. Is that just a random? Oh my gosh. <laughs> My computer is like, why are you doing this to me, huh? Why you gotta mine so many leaves, dude? Okay. Okay, I'm not even close to full of leaves. Okay. There's probably a ton of leaves on the ground I just haven't picked up yet, but... Oh my gosh. There are so many leaves in the jungle. I'm glad I'm doing this now, rather than later, because then I'll have room for my projects. But I don't want to spend the entire video just mining these leaves. But it's looking like most of it's going to be spent doing this, but... We'll do some fun. We'll make a bridge and make it look nice. I think that should be far enough for now. I don't want to go any further that way. So, okay, we have a pretty decent area now. Um, 
decent enough. I may, like, it may turn out that I want to break these big trees, but for now, I'm just going to leave them. I'm going to try to make this look as good as possible uh, without making it look like I went in here and just straight wrecked everything. I have torches on me, don't I? Yes, okay. This area definitely needs to be lit up, so we'll go ahead and just place a few torches on the ground just so that things don't start spawning over here. And so we can work through the night, which is always fun. So we'll just put torches just around everything just to make sure that uh, we're not in the dark when we're doing this. Yeah, this won't be too bad. This is already really nice. I already know this is going to turn out really cool just to have an area over here. I know it's kind of annoying watching me do it, but I promise once I'm actually done and you actually get to see it, it's going to be a lot cooler. And then you probably think, I have a good way of envisioning things in my head. I don't like have a method, but I know this sounds weird and this sounds really cringy, but sometimes when I dream, I dream in Minecraft. Yeah, like I'm, uh, <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but like, I will be in Minecraft, like the world is blocky. And I know that sounds fake, but like I've played this game so much that my brain just, it's like second nature. It's like, oh yeah, okay, we're just playing Minecraft. Yep, okay, but we're in a dream. But yeah, I'm just like, okay, cool. We're in Minecraft this time. <laughs> it's not all the time. It's not super common, but it has happened. And I'm just like, uh, okay. But I guess I'm, what I'm trying to say, the point I'm trying to get at is I can sort of visualize, visualize things in my head, even not in Minecraft, like in real life. And I, I, I don't know, it's kind of a good skill to have, definitely. If you were going to be like a builder or something, I want to go into business. So <laughs> it's not useful at all, but... You know, I still got time to figure it out, and I like playing this game, especially during college when, you know, it's not, it's no fun to work like a job that you make like so little money on, but it's definitely worth it, like, to do this, and I'm very lucky, but I've done this so long, it doesn't feel like I deserve, it, I definitely don't deserve it, I'm not gonna put it that way, there are people that would be much more deserving of this, but I have worked a long time to get to the point where I'm at, like, it was not an overnight thing, I, I've been doing YouTube for six years, and uh, I, I peaked before this. This is the biggest peak I've ever had, by the way, which is incredible. But back in like 2015, I think was 2015 or 16 was like my biggest peak. And it was crazy because I was getting like 800 subs a day. But now I'm getting over a thousand a day. Like, what is that? That is literally crazy to me. That is so, so crazy to me. I just think it's incredible personally. But we're going to have a ton of wood, like more than we're ever going to need. And yeah, that axe is gone. Probably not actually that much wood, but since it's all spread out, but it looks like a lot. But these little trees, I want to mine these. I don't, I don't want to keep anything but the big trees. Hopefully, I can mine all this. Actually, it doesn't even matter because I just have these leaves I can use. Okay, but uh, yeah, I may clear this out off camera. I don't think that's a big deal, right? Just me clearing out these little logs and stuff. I don't know. Maybe you guys want to see it. I'm not really sure, but like all these logs right here. Let me finish those real quick. Okay, so a little thought I had. I know that there's stripped logs in the game now. I think they're added in 1.13, but how do you craft them? I thought it was maybe like... <laughs> I thought it was maybe like... Th oh. <laughs> I guess when I first did it, I just put one in, and you need to do three. But yeah, I'm going to have a ton of wood after doing this. I just realized I, I said I'm going to do this area over here, but that was like all the rest of it. So I decided to hop back on the camera. I need to get a little dirt and fill in that divot. But this will give us a good area to do some stuff on. Um, yeah, this was the edge right here. So, And we can always make this bigger or smaller as needed. But this mountain right here will sort of be the divider. And maybe we'll build a wall around it or something. Build a wall. <laughs> Don't even get me stuck. That guy is just crazy. Like, I am a Republican. But I'm, I think I'm very liberal when it comes to, um, uh, like like social issues like but like at the same time it's just like that guy is just that should not be that shouldn't i, I don't know i don't want to i don't want to talk about politics but yeah i don't even know why i started talking because i said i'm gonna build a wall <laughs> so we may build a minecraft wall but uh yeah this area is looking pretty pretty snazzy i'm gonna get in here and uh attempt if i can oh that's weird and bouncy we bouncy 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 um i'm gonna try to get this tree out and then i think that's the last thing Ooh, fun cool and then okay so i don't know if there's any other little trees i would really want to break except this one right here okay yeah there's a bunch of them okay i may not be done as soon as i thought so this episode um this is episode five so i think for the fifth episode we're getting pretty far we haven't done a whole lot but i haven't played survival minecraft in a while so i'm gonna be doing this i'm gonna be just kind of taking it at my own pace 
if I was trying to speed run, I'd already have diamond, but what's the fun in like just digging down a mine and just getting diamond on the second day? Like, I mean, it's kind of fun the first few times, but I'm trying to take this slow. And I want to make this series last a while, so I'm just going to sort of do things at my own pace. Ooh, Coco Beats. I'm going to try to take things at my own pace and just sort of do them as I want. Uh, I'm not going to make it boring or anything like that. I'm just saying that I want this series to last uh, probably around 100 episodes. I'm not really sure exactly. I really don't have a plan for it, but I do want it to last a good bit. Is it a jungle sapling? We definitely want that. Definitely want that. Okay, is there any more jungle? Actually, wait, no. I was thinking of spruce. Okay. <laughs> well, anyways... Is that all mined? Yeah, okay. I'm gonna go put this enormous amount of plant materials up, which we may not end up needing at all, and we'll probably have a big chest storage area, but now we have a bunch of wood, and I think I probably have more wood than I can hold, so I might need to go and get some more, but yeah, this is a lot of leaves. Yeah, <laughs> almost a full almost a full thing of leaves. That's interesting. Oh, there's leaves in here too, so stack those up. Okay, and then right here, what? Oh. Right here, just gonna put the rest of these plant materials up and then mob drops and stuff. I'll put the bone right there. Okay, so what I wanted to do, I have that area cleared out. I want to make this area look a little bit better. So I'm gonna need a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna need fence, but I don't wanna make it out of spruce. Actually, yeah, we'll make them out of jungle just because we have so much. So let's just craft a bunch of uh, these right here. And then let's go into this. This is so much easier than having to put it in here. No, that's not. Why is there a search icon there if you can't so show craftable? Okay. Yeah, I want jungle fence and I want. Oh, I thought it removed it all from inventory. That's why I paused. I was like, what? Okay. You know what? We'll just do that. That should be enough fence. If we need more fence than that, uh, we shouldn't need more fence than that. Okay. And then maybe a few trap doors out of jungle because they look really cool. Okay. Okay, so we should be able to design this now. Let's sleep first things first. Let's get that out of the way. Okay, nice. And I also want to check if I have any extra sand because I want to get that smelting for a project on the melon farm. But I don't think I do. I'll have to go mine that. Probably off camera because I don't think you guys want to see that. But I have somewhat of an idea for this. I'm not really sure if it's going to turn out, but one, two, three. I kind of want to just have little pillars here, just three block space apart, and then just sort of, um, one, two, three, something like this. So I know you guys like watching me build, so I'll try to build as much as I can in this series. Although, uh, yeah, I'll just have to put it in the wall right there. That's fine. Okay. So I know lanterns are really cool, but my question is, can they hang off a fence? First of all. Okay. That's really cool. That's good to know. Okay. Let's break that. I don't want to do that. I just wanted to make sure. Okay, so what I want to do is have these bridges be fenced across like this and then have trap doors under them. And I think it's not like it's a secure fence, but I just want these bridges to look nice because otherwise they just look a little a little weird. But that's kind of cool that we have like a cave like right in there. It's also a pain place in these when you can't line yourself up. <laughs> the struggles of playing actual <laughs> the actual game. I'm so used to building in creative if you die if you can't tell. Okay, but what I wanted to do is put trap doors like 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 under these fence like that something like that I feel like that's gonna look good does it look yeah that looks decent okay and then we can just sort of put lanterns like okay you can't put <laughs> we'll figure out a place to put lanterns but I did want to add a bunch of lanterns here just because they're new and they're kind of fun but okay normally I'd skip this if I was in creative so should I skip it in survival that's that's the grand question because I really don't know I also have no idea how long I've been recording either, but that's okay. All right. Um, okay, maybe just because I don't want these floor torches anymore. Those are those are unacceptable. Let's try to get up. Do I have any blocks? Yeah, this would be easy. Okay, let's get up like right here, and then another block higher. I want to hang these lanterns like in between like this, and then just have the lantern hanging down. That doesn't like bug. That doesn't really. No, that's not too bad. Okay, and then. I know the lanterns light up a pretty good area, but I also want to do it like right here. So we'll just come up here, grab the fence, put it not right there. That's the complete wrong spot. Put it right there. And then we can, uh, we can hang this. Okay, cool. So now we've got a nice little bridge. Uh, definitely looks a lot better than the other ones. It's going to be, it's not a huge project or anything. I hope I have enough fence. I might not, but I didn't realize that these are going to take that long. 
but I may not record all of them on camera just because that's that's like it's like the same repetition. But uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Okay, let's see if we can do the same thing over here. Yeah, we're gonna run out of spruce logs before anything. Okay, so one, two, two, do, 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 one, two, three, boop, 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 break the torch. One, two, three, boop, 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 boop. Boop, boop, boop. Blip. There we go. We use a blip instead of a boop there. Um, okay, one, two, three, and then do it again, and then one, two, three, do it again, and then we should just be able to. Yeah, we can just sort of modify this right here. Hopefully that doesn't make the water all freaked out. And it totally does. We'll, we'll fix it, we'll fix it, and then just right here. Okay. So I'm not gonna record me doing the exact same thing I just did because that's that's really that's kind of boring and it's kind of a pain to place this fence as well. It may be easier if I got like on top, but I don't. I, oh yeah, we're gonna need a bunch more stuff. We may not be able to get these bridges done. I'm kind of overbuilding these, especially for the beginning of the game, but I really want it to look. I want this world to look absolutely incredible. That's what I'm gonna be focusing on. I don't know if you guys liked that house yet because I have not uploaded episode three, but I'm on recording. This is episode five. Yeah. No, this is episode six. This is six, isn't it? Did I say welcome to episode five? Huh, I gotta listen now. I'm curious. Okay, so it is episode five. I just put all the files in a folder that said episode five and I thought that I'd already recorded it, but I said it right in the beginning of the video, but I record a lot so I don't always remember what I say, which is kind of kind of weird. Okay, I need to get more jungle wood. I think I actually have a lot of jungle wood, like a lot more, but I think I wasted it all on this fence. Please tell me I didn't. Okay, yeah, we have a good bit more. Okay, because we're gonna need a ton of trapdoors. More than I'm gonna be able to just craft here real quick. So let's just, okay, I can do this quicker, right? Yeah, okay, wait. Jungle trapdoors, okay. There we go, that should be enough, maybe. I'm not sure, we definitely have enough lanterns, but I love these lanterns, they are so cool. Okay, so let me just place these trapdoors real quick. Okay, and then we'll be sure to break all the torches on the path. And then we're gonna get up on top and do that same sort of pattern that we did. Just go over, I'm talking in my tutorial voice. That's not what you need to do, Neo. You need to engage, engage your audience. So there we go. And then we'll put one in the middle, which seems to be like eh, about here. I'm not gonna be too stringent on dimensions or anything, like trying to get everything super even, but I definitely want it to look good. And I've got an eye for building, a little bit, <laughs> a little bit of an eye for building. So I'll try to make it look good or as good as I can. I'm really not that great. You guys praise me as like the best builder ever, but I'm not like, you guys say I'm better than Grian or Grian or whatever, however you say his name, but he is so, I, I don't want to say he, he, we build in different styles, but he is definitely like objectively a lot better of a builder than I am. And I know a lot of his videos, or I think some of his videos that he uses build teams and stuff. So maybe it's a little bit of an unfair advantage to a degree. But I don't know, he's definitely a very talented builder. I wouldn't really say anyone's better than anyone. We all just build a little bit differently. Um, okay. But objectively, there are some better people and Grian is definitely better than me. I, I feel like that at least. I don't know, like, I don't know. He he didn't do it, it, it kind of, it, it made me a little bit jealous, right? Because last summer I tried to record and it just wasn't working out for me. And that's fine, I don't always want it to be perfect, but he was like blowing up and he had like just started from what I understand, at least started doing Minecraft. I hadn't heard of him before then. And uh, he was like blowing up past me. And I was just like, man, come on, <laughs> my, are my videos that bad? And they weren't great. I did not have very good, um, oh, that's a lot easier if I do it like that, okay. I didn't have the greatest uh, setup as far as like thumbnails went, I just thought that my thumbnails were good and they couldn't really get much better than I had. But yeah, my thumbnails were pretty terrible and, it, and that's honestly one of the biggest factors, believe it or not, when people click on a video. Because think about it, it's the first thing you see on a video and uh, if it looks bad, then you're gonna have to just think the video is bad. And my thumbnails were bad and then I got better at them and I still use a program called paint.net. It's free, it's freeware, and it's honestly one of the greatest pieces of software ever made. It's not as good as GIMP, but I never really learned how to use GIMP, so I don't use it. Not not knocking on GIMP, it's definitely better than paint.net, objectively speaking, but I like paint.net a lot better. And not my it's not Microsoft Paint, don't worry, I'm not, I'm not using that Microsoft Paint stuff, but it's a similar name, and it, it, it's a good piece of software. So we do have that dungeon, and I did not forget about it, but, yeah, we're definitely gonna have to dig out like some stuff around like these pathways because otherwise they're like these pathways and they look nice But they lead to nothing <laughs> They're just like 
It's like it's like kind of over here. It's a little bit better, but I think these are pretty cool. Let me know if you guys are liking these bridges. But when I walk here, it's like okay, here, here you go. You get to go in this cave. I don't even remember what's in here, but I kind of want to play around with the spawner a little bit and see what we can do. But let me check the episode length and then put these building materials back in their rightful places. So I know my wood. Oh, I really need to make item frames. I'm gonna say that and then never do it. Just watch me. Okay, let's put all this wood stuff up and let's just take. We're just gonna take a bunch of cobblestone yeah we're gonna take a bunch of cobblestone we're gonna go in there and we're just gonna see what happens i don't know i doubt that we'll actually get the spawner built but i definitely want to get something going in there just because it's kind of fun to kill mobs just like yeah i don't mean that in some like weird psychotic way it's just kind of fun to like uh, well that's not weird actually i just like to kill them i think it's fun to get their loot but someone said to switch it to hard when I do it and it will help me out and I know that there's water messed up in two places so let me go ahead and fix it over here first okay and then there's water over here messed up next to this melon farm yes like that and then okay well yeah I'll go ahead and mine these just because if I don't I feel like I'm like not doing it right what's the point of having all these melons if I don't use them but that's definitely a good starter source of food in the jungle but I know most time Ooh. Most of the time you're not going to spawn in a jungle. That's kind of a rare spawn. But let's go over here into this dungeon and let's just sort of... Let me bring two water buckets. Let's just see what we can get started with it because... Okay, I need to... Okay, here, let's just do this by hand because I don't want to go get shears. I'm too lazy, but we'll just break out a little bit of this stuff just so that it feels a little bit better over here because we're just like... You just straight walk into leaves. But yeah, let me check the episode length before I start this to know how far in depth I can go with it. I'm sad guys because I have to do this. We're at 26 minutes and unfortunately we're gonna have to save the mob spawner for episode 6 or whatever we're gonna do with the mob spawner but I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We got a ton of stuff done. We got these bridges built. We got this whole area cleared out and I really hope you guys are enjoying the series. Let me know in the comments how you're enjoying it thus far and uh, if you want to see me do anything specific just sort of let me know and I'll see what I can work into the series but yeah thank you guys for all the amazing support thus far. I have up to episode 5 I guess recorded or wait Four. yeah episode five recorded so i have only uploaded the first two as of recording this so i'm not sure how everything's going yet but the first episode has like thirty thousand views or so and that's really awesome i thought it wasn't gonna do that well but there's a lot of new people around here since thanks to that three by three ultimate three by three base that i made but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in episode five i totally meant six <laughs>